Hey people, it's see it's Andy uh, Cloudy Mulder. Now I wouldn't really normally do a video like this, but um, I have actually been so impressed by the packaging on an album I bought recently, I thought I would share it with you guys. Now, this record is uh, it's the new release by Amulet, and it's called The Inevitable War. Now, Amulet are a British... Um, traditional, modern traditional uh, metal band that have been inactive for, for quite some time. They released their first album, which I showed recently, um, I can't fall from the film, but it's called, it, it's called, uh, yeah, so the first album was called The First. Get a bit silly now. Anyway, so that was their first album. But then they had various lineup changes and, um, it has taken about five years for them to release their second album. I bought it on pre-order uh, from Plastic Head uh, Music, Plastic Head Records, and um, it arrived in a nicely uh, secure vinyl box, plenty of tape, lots of fragile signs on it. This is always a good sign, especially as you see the box has you know, fair about a bashes in, but um, the record was perfectly safe within here. But not only that didn't impress me, well that impressed me, but not as much as the fact that the record itself uh, arrived nicely shrinked. But that's not it. It came with a stiffener within the shrink. I have never ever bought a record where the, um, the company has uh, effectively not laminated, but you know, they, they put the shrink wrap around the record and the stiffener to keep the record perfectly protected and flat. In fact, let's, let's crack it open now. Obviously, if you're so, a bit of a one of these purists that likes to keep things sealed forever, then you're going to have a big chunk of cardboard stuck on your shelf as well. But uh, good, look at that, quality cardboard stiffener. And, oh wow, it's also sealed as well. So I thought they'd actually put the uh, cardboard in the seal, but no, um, the record itself is sealed. So double, double. Let's crack this one open and have a, a first look. I have heard, I've tried to avoid listening to this album online, but I did uh, take a peek at a couple of the, uh, the songs on there. And... Um, yeah, so there we have it. Amulet, the inevitable war. Um, track listing, beautiful artwork. Um, and that is a gatefold. An artwork that needs to be on an album. And here we have the uh, inside of the gatefold. And it's a single album release. Not a polyline sleeve, but... Uh, We have the lyrics and uh, picture of the band. Now, look at that for a, some striking young men. The new vocalist, yeah, Federico Mace Mazza. He's got a, a good set of pipes on him, and it is on. All stuck in with the static. It's on this nice uh, translucent green vinyl, which you can't see, it's uh, pretty opaque there, but uh, believe me, it uh, looks much nicer when I'm looking at it with the light above my head here. Ooh, maybe dropped it. So that will go into a polyline sleeve pretty soon. But the other thing that came with it as well, so a lot of places throw in the various merch, so we've got something for uh, Samurai, uh, Summer Studio, and we've got some flyers for uh, Heavy Sounds, Psych Sounds, and I don't know, uh, Heavy Sounds, Psych Records, some High Reaper. So we've got the usual little bits of merch as well, but what I thought was pretty cool is they've thrown a bunch of flexi discs in. These are all playable uh, 45, 45 RPM, I think. Uh, I've not given each of these a go yet. I'm probably going to swap out and put a, my old stylus in first. But I thought I'd give them a go. I thought this was quite nice. So that's all. That was a Charger Crackdown. And this is uh, Charger 
victim. I can just about see, if I get the light right, the, uh, you can see my face through it, which is a great view, but if you can just see the, the grooves on here as well. Um, so I've got another one for the Agra lights. It says reggae and now on the bottom. Never heard of these bands, but uh, again, such a nice kind of thing to, to stick in when you buy something. I mean, I'll certainly look at plastic head records again. Uh, this is the Slackers Peculiar. Again, another uh, flexi disc. Uh, you can see the, uh, the grooves on it better there. But I'll give these a go and see what they sound like. But uh, yeah, such a thought, such a, a cool um, marketing tool in the day of the, the modern age and everything. And uh, it's great to see flexi discs also making a little bit of a comeback. Uh, so there we have it. Yeah, just my uh, quick show off of the new Amulet album on vinyl. But also uh, my hats off to Plastic Head. Let me just make sure I get their name right. Plastic Head Music for their uh, superb packaging and marketing material that they send out to. Thanks for watching. Catch you again soon.